folks. All right, folks, don't change this. You're about to see in between my legs here. Uh, and it is quite funny for those of you that haven't experienced this. Here's some really quick images of exactly what's going on. Um, it's very important for you guys to do this correctly and to know how to do it before something like this happens. Uh, I ended up pulling the tick myself, so uh, here, enjoy. Well, I got my freaking pants around my ankles. Why the, why the, why the hell do I got them around my ankles? Because well, I ain't going to show you. Well, right about there, I got a freaking tick on my balls, all right? I'm not too happy about this. The thing is moving around. I'm holding my nuts, by the way, in my hand. It's got its teeth in me. And my dog is yapping. So I'm going to tell you how this is going to happen. I got my wife here. I've got a flashlight. Um, how do you remove a tick? All right. You remove a tick by, you don't want to scare the tick because if you scare the tick, it's going to basically spit inside you. And I don't want his saliva in my nuts. So you're going to take a pair of tweezers and you're going to gently pull straight up. After you pull straight up, he's going to, you're basically pulling his teeth out of you. Okay. Now the area does seem a little red. You know? <laughs> I wish I could show you guys this, but I can't because YouTube will delete this video. But uh, anyway, it's a rather large tick. It's uh, pretty big. I usually feel them walking on me. This is the first one that's actually attached itself to me. Um, luckily, it's attached itself to my nuts. Um, but you pull straight up, and after you pull straight up, if you want to know if you got the teeth or not, you can actually see the teeth. So you pull up and you'll see you'll see the tick and you'll see its little teeth right there. If you don't see its teeth, that means the teeth are still stuck in you. And they're basically just going to stay in there, which is not a good thing. But I guess that's life. Um, I'll give you an update on how this is going to go. All right. So I got my wife over here. Honey, are you going to come pull this tick off me? I figured I might as well film this. Um, so, sweetie, I guess something's more important than this. See, these are my, you know, these are my jewels. This is, uh, um, this is like the most important thing that should be going on in this house right now. Even my cat knows something's going on. Hi, cat. How's it going? Yeah. Oh, look. You wonder why daddy has his pants around his ankles. Well, it's because I got a tick on me. Yeah, a tick on my, on my jewels. Yeah. So. Yeah, something's more important like cleaning the counter or something. So we'll see what's going on. Sweetie? Hello? All right, well, we'll see. Hi, honey. Okay, I'm gonna explain to you how to pull a tick. Oh, well, I figured I'd film this. It's okay. Sweet, would you come here and pull this thing off me? Okay, it's off. Okay, the camera's gonna go off. Okay, I'll, I'll give you an update later. Here we go. Okay, folks, I just pulled the tick off my nuts, okay? So we're going to check this out. We're going to see if... got the teeth or not. See this here. Let me see if I can get this as good as possible for you. All right, now if you look really closely, you see the legs, right? Okay, you see the two big legs that are sticking out. You see the three prongs. All right, you see those three prongs right there? 
That's what you want to make sure you got. And I got it. Now I do have a little red dot where he is at. It's a good idea to disinfect the area with a little alcohol afterwards. And uh, that's about it. This is my freaking little tick friend. I might keep him and torture him. Little son of a gun. Look at him wrapping around this thing. And he's still moving. Little sucker. I'm going to flush him down the toilet.